Hey guys, so obviously I just like keep changing up setups, but I knew that I would be like dancing a whole lot because I can't listen to these songs without dancing. Today I'm going to be doing my favorite Christian songs slash worship songs. Some of these are worship. Most of these are just like songs that I love. I feel like personally you can worship to any song. It doesn't have to be a slow song to worship to. The point of music to me i hear the words of the music and that just really moves me if you listen to k-love then like literally all the songs on there are my favorite songs i haven't heard a song on k-love that i've been like ooh, i do not like this but i couldn't just play k-love and be like this is my favorite this is my favorite i do have quite a bit of songs i have 23 so that's kind of a lot i have these all on a playlist on youtube so you can go listen to them because obviously i can't play the full song because copyright reasons and then that would make this video an hour long i don't know I'll probably just do like the chorus amount. I love all these songs. Every time I listen to this, I just feel like so like, yes, you know, that's what I'm going to be doing in this video. And I did just film this look and it will be up before this. So I'll link it up here. The first one is I Just Need You by Toby Mac. This is actually a newer one. The first time I heard it, I was just like, it just makes me feel so good and like pumped up. <laughs> a teaser right i'll link my playlist up here but like this is just such a good one let's move on to the next song go come to the altar by elevation worship just having to play the chorus because like the rest of the song is so good now, this next song if you listen to k-love or any other christian radio station this song has kind of been a little overplayed i don't get tired of this song i love it so much it's reckless love by Corey asbury <laughs> is What a Beautiful Name by Hillsong Worship. I love whenever they do like where the crowd sings that just like gives me chills this next one is also a newer finding and it's called i surrender by hillsong I just like such a powerful song you have to listen to the whole thing but this is no longer slaves by jonathan david and melissa helser no this one is resurrection power by chris tomlin Chris Tomlin, it's called God and God Alone. This next one 
next one is So Will I by Hillsong United. Does anyone else know the difference between Hillsong United and Hillsong Worship? I don't know the difference. And as you speak, I you building galaxies in the vapor of your breath. And Jessica Gabriel released their like greater album, but I don't have any iTunes gift cards right now and I really need to get them. The next one is Wonder by Hillsong United. This is North Point inside out, death was arrested. This is so good. When death was arrested, my life began. Oh, your grace, so free. Watch is over me. You have made me new. Now life begins with you. I love her voice. This is King of My Heart by Bethel Worship. Let the King of my heart. This song has such a powerful message. All of these have a powerful message. This one is Natalie Grant more than anything. Help me walk the You should want Jesus more than you want what he's giving you. You want to follow Christ because of who he is, not because what he is going to do for you. This is Unstoppable God by Elevation Worship. Unstoppable God, let you go. Yours by Elevation Worship. That song is so so good. This is Mercy Me, even if I just love listening to this whole song. You have to listen to the whole song. The beginning it gets me. But then the chorus is good too. They say sometimes you win some, sometimes you lose some. And right now, right now I'm losing back. I know you're able to go alive, though you can sing through the fire with your mighty hand. But if you admit you don't, my heart is in you alone. This is Johnny Diaz Breathe. It's a really catchy song, but also it's just so true. Control by 10th Avenue North. I definitely recommend you check out 10th Avenue North because they are one of my favorite bands. Like, they're like, I love all of these, but you know, I have like four other songs by them on here too. But this one is a newer one. All their other songs are like old, old. <laughs> Next one is Holy Spirit by Francesca Bettistelli. If we're 
Honest by Francesca Battistelli. Everyone has a heart that loves to hide. Yeah, it may be hard, but the best thing we could ever do. Bring your brokenness and I'll bring mine. Cause love can heal what hurt divides. And mercy's waiting on the other side. This is You Are More by 10th Avenue North. You are more by 10th Avenue North. Let me see redemption win. Let me know the struggle ends. That you can mend a heart that's frail and so And all that's dead inside can be reborn. This is also a newer one. I actually saw them live and they told the story behind this and one of the guys in the band, uh, his wife had cancer. They wrote this song while she was going through it and this is I Have This Hope by Tim Dunn, New York. I have this hope I just remembered a song, so no, that wasn't the last one. So tell me why, tell me why we divide it. If we're gonna fight, let's fight for each other. If we're gonna shout, then let me cry. We all agree the same. So tell me why, tell me why we divide it. That's all my like standout favorite Christian songs, just listen to any Christian radio station and you will hear <laughs> most of these songs. I just recommend that you have it on the in the car. These just put me in such a good mood and just go and listen to this whole playlist and just listen to the words. A lot of people think that Christian song is like, why do you like, it's always slow, it's so boring. But as you can see, those songs I don't think are boring. They definitely aren't slow. I mean, some of them are, but they're worship songs. Some people just get on my nerves because they're like, I don't want to listen to your music. And I'm like, well, I'm providing the gas. So you're gonna, you're gonna listen to them. Or they're like, can I plug in my phone? I'm like, hmm, are you playing Christian music? Didn't think so. I feel like this whole video is literally me saying, oh, this is so powerful. Most of these, I literally don't know what to say about them because if you don't hear the whole song, then you can't like hear what I'm saying. The beginning and ending have a lot of the powerful messages just because it is like the slower part. I definitely do recommend you go listen to these songs. These are so close to my heart. Just look up Caleb and see what radio station it is where you live. I really hope y'all enjoyed this video. Hopefully it wasn't too boring like me just, you know, sitting here singing I, it's kind of cringy even if you did just click on this video and look at my playlist like that's fine my place is up in the cards and the little thingy and it's also down below just go listen to them you won't regret it tell us all down below your favorite songs so we can also listen to those oh I had a girl comment, God's not dead. Did I not add that? I thought that I did. I have God's not dead. I'll just listen to that one too because you said to put it in this video. My God's not dead, he's surely alive. He's I know I did a little dance. For VBS one year we did that. That is my favorite Christian songs worship songs. Hopefully this video wasn't too annoying and boring. If you enjoyed this video, you should probably go check out my other videos because they're going to be a lot better than this one. I also did just upload how to have a godly relationship. If you did like this video, I would love it if you subscribe down below. Please leave any video recommendations down below. Anything you want me to do, thank you so much for watching. Bye!